The Mousers are a creation of a, of a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles villain character called Baxter Stockman. He's a doctor, he's a scientist. And in the original comic book, he was creating these as a, a way to get rats out of the sewers. Basically, we sent them down in the sewers and they would eat the rats. And then there's a plate on the back of the mouser's butt that you open that up to get the rat or what was left of the rat out of there to clean them out. And April O'Neil in the original series had actually been working for Baxter Stockman as a computer programmer. And she figured out there was kind of something weird going on and there was these a rash of bank robberies happened. And when she confronted him, he took her down to his lab and said, yes, these mousers are being used as my way to rob banks. So um, there's like armies of these things and uh, the turtles had to pretty much break up the doc's uh, diabolical plan. And the cool thing about it is there were so many, so there was a lot of cool fight scenes with them. So it turned out to be kind of like a foot soldier, but more of a, instead of like having an actual do physical martial arts combat with them. It was just wading through all these Mausers at once. So we thought a good idea for Comic-Con would be to create a Mauser and uh, have it in scale with the other four Ninja Turtle figures that we're doing, the statues. And the cool thing about this is that it's Comic-Con exclusive, but also there's two different portraits for it. There's a closed mouth portrait and open mouth portrait. So you can pretty much decide which head you want to have on them and have them display with. And we just put in some real cool details. We went back to the original Mouser design, um, especially the, the mechanics of it, which are, are real simplistic, but really cool in a simple kind of way. And the neat thing is that they added a little bit of the green ooze that created the Ninja Turtles. You could see it leaking out of the pipe underneath the street. 